guess where we are. We always have a packed schedule when we're here. Tonight is like the one exception. A lot of people left when it started pouring, which makes sense, but it didn't scare us away. Guess where we are. Just ended back up at Universal. Whoops. We made it to Hogsmeade. This was just a complete last minute trip. We're flying out tomorrow morning and we just wanted to have something to do before, like instead of just sitting in the hotel. So here we are. The only cost was the parking, so we just want to use our annual passes again. People are flooding out because the weather doesn't look great. I don't mind it. And also people are flooding in to Halloween Horror Nights, which we are not doing this time. So I thought it'd be nice to go into Islands of Adventure instead. Hopefully Halloween Horror Nights will like draw more people. But yeah, I think we're just going to like sit around honestly and just explore. All of the outdoor rides are closed, of course, but we didn't come here to do any rides because we don't have express passes. But it's just so much fun to like hang out in Hogsmeade. Right now we're headed down past Velocicoaster just for fun. And I'm like really surprised looking at this that I rode this the other day. Like it looks very intense. It was very intense, but it was fun too. So we're just going to walk around between rainstorms. It looks like, I mean, if you look, over there, it's still pretty dark. It's moving that way, but we just wanted to get out. We were like hiding outside Filch's Emporium. So doing a little loop here and there aren't too many people because the Lost Coaster is closed. But you can tell there are like a lot of people on the move heading out. So it's nice to be in here and want to be in here even though rides are closed. The only open rides are the indoor ones and the wake times are insane. So especially with that express passes, we will not be participating. <laughs> what was I gonna say? Oh, we're keeping track of when the thunder and lightning is so we can like reset because they don't start the rides for another like 30 minutes after the last lightning. So we're keeping track and we keep saying like, oh, reset and just reset again. It's, it was really, really loud at first when we like just got our bags looked through or like we went through security in City Walk and it was like really loud in there we were like oh no we already paid for parking like what is this gonna be but it's funny we keep like resetting oh oh no more rides no more rides that's not why we're here we're here to just have fun but it's an entertaining game we're also playing the who has a cool lounge oh there was another one reset we're also playing the who has a cool lounge fly game so we're admiring those but yeah, we made it around our loop. We're just going to hang out again. I think that was more lightning. We're standing behind the three broomsticks and just reset again. I'm sure it will again again because there's like another van moving through, but it's just fun to sit here and watch. It's a nice view back here too. I would like to like get a table sometime and eat back here, like under the tent. I think that'd be fun. I haven't, we haven't eaten at the Three Broomsticks ever. They do supposedly have gluten-free options, but we haven't tried them because it's always a really long line and we're always in a rush to go on Hagrid's or to get over to Universal to ride Gringotts in the morning. Like we always have a packed schedule when we're here. Tonight is like the one exception because we're trying to usually take advantage of the express passes and early recognition from staying at a hotel and we don't have that right now so we just get to like 
stand around, which is pretty fun. Heading up now, all the rides have just started testing, but we are not going to participate in the crazy lines that are still there. Um, there were a bunch of people in Velocicoaster line still. I think they said 90 minutes of people still in the line for Hagrid's, which was closed two and a half hours ago. So those people have been waiting a really long time and I do not want to jump into such a long line, especially this late. So we're going to head out. I had a lot of fun tonight. All we had to do was pay for the parking and then we just had like a park evening, which was really fun. There aren't too many people here because I think a lot of people are at Halloween Horror Nights and then a lot of people left when it started pouring, which makes sense, but it didn't scare us away. So I hope you guys enjoyed coming along for our little park evening. Um, check out some of my other Universal vlogs. I have a lot of them at this point. Make sure to follow me on all social media at Rosie Revolts. Check out my Etsy shop, also at Rosie Revolts, and my book at GetOutdoorsBook.com, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. So I have a funny story. We just saw one train go through Hulk with people on it. All the other rides were testing. Then I saw a flash. I'm like, was that lightning? Was it? And then we hear the thunder. So I'm guessing everything's going to be shut down again, like, right away. So I guess it's good that we're on our way out because everyone else is going to be on their way out too because the park closes pretty soon and they are not going to get on the rides.